in press down and scoop the abdomen the neck is long inhale up exhale down abdomen in four five abdomen in four four work with your breath guys contract the abdomen inhale up let's do three more yuji abdomen in to match the breath with your movement become one with your breath uh just this is two again and one more perfect beautiful good so what's another one here uh bring it back up and off like that marilyn the abdomen is in press that was beautiful yuji off Bring the legs apart, neck is long, four, five. Abdomen in, four, four, perfect, Tony. Extend through your awesome fingers, three, two. You guys may be feeling the shoulders right now, okay? Two again. So the idea is to work the scapula. And one, and coming back down, beautiful, good. So now let's do the other one, similar to that one. So you come back up, but this time only the right arm comes down. Contract, do the right leg arm again for four. That one, that one again. Again, contract. Uh, three, contract. Two, that's beautiful, Marilyn. Two again, that one, and bow, one, like that, bow. Good, nice, Tony. The other side, slowly down, and uh, contract the abdomen. So you guys notice this exercise, very few individuals out there, out there are doing these kind of exercises like this, like that, strengthening the shoulder girdle. Two, contract. One and come back here now. Contract the abdomen, rotate the neck for three, for two, for one, gently reverse for three, for two, for one. Beautiful. Good. Let's work the tricep. The tricep. So I take the band in my right hand and I throw it behind me, like sit here, and I grab it. And I bring my right, I, I pull it down a little bit. I contract the abdomen, my right leg is forward. And I press up like that, Marilyn. And I press up to work the back of the arm. That one, Val, that one, Jean, that one, Tony. Yes, good, bending the elbow, right? There you go. Bend the elbow, four, that one, Jean. Bend the elbow, four again. That one, keep go and Good, and two, and one. Okay, perfect, good, everyone, good. The other side. Here, slowly, Joe, and press up, and down, up, and down. Good, there you go. Six, UG. five, Marilyn, four, uh, three, Tony. Two, keep go. One, wow, beautiful. Good, let's work the shoulders again from a different angle. So you want it nice and tight here, nice and tight. The palms are long. So this is, you know, we have, round, many of us have round shoulders because we were too much on the computer. So you want to bring the shoulders back, gently press the scapula and then come back this way. So from here, come back this way and then like that, Gigi. Like that, Marilyn, good, perfect, go. There you go, Bob. Good, so keep the shoulders, um, the scapula, the shoulder blades towards each other. They're, they're touching each other because you're strengthening the muscles behind the scapula to strengthen the muscles in the front, in the anterior. So we guys are doing eight, seven, mm, lift through the crown of the head, uh, six, five, Four, that one, Tony. Three, oh, two, 
And one, good, good, good. Okay, so now keep the band, grab your mini ball. And let's see how we're gonna do this one, Joe. Let's see. So you want a very long band, very long. You guys have done some of this before, but from a different perspective, okay? So from here, it is long this way, Kiko, you see? So I have one end like that, Marilyn, perfect. Bring it up more, Val, bring it up more. You got it, Jean? Tony, yes, you do yes, Kiko, yes. Now bring it down and then put both feet inside. Now take the mini ball, you guys have your mini ball. Kiko, you're, you're on it. Yeah, that's it. Place the mini ball between the inner thighs. So that will, and then bring it as much as possible. My, my band is so sticky. Um, you want to bring the, your feet as close as possible because I want all these muscles from the pelvic ball to be contracted. Everything inside to be contracted. So where am I here? So from here, Eugene, uh, grab towards the end. Marilyn, be careful in this one. The arms are straight. And then I gently contract the abdomen, squeeze the ball, and do small circles. Small circles. The, the, your, my, it is better if you have light um, band, because if you have a hard one, it's challenging. So you, you bring the arms lower if it's too hard for you, okay? Otherwise, you want to bring it up to shoulder height. Keep going, I'm gonna show you sideways. Here, like that, here, like that. Four, three, two, and then if only if it's possible, the arms are a little bit straighter, okay? And then reverse it, reverse it. If not, bend the elbows, if that's easier for you, okay? Uh, where am I? Six, squeeze the ball, don't forget the ball. Five, four, three, yes. Two, one, that was hard. Good, now I bring it back down slower, contract the abdomen, and this one is called biceps. Here, biceps, here, biceps. Keep the ball active, stay long. You go 10, nine, eight, seven. Work in the front of the arms, six, five, four. <clears throat> Three, two, one, good. We do one more here. So from here, grab lower if you can. And then from here, the zipper up. That one, Mary, good. I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna show you sideways. So bring the elbows. You notice how my elbows are coming up like that, uh, like that, Eugene. Let's see, Jean. There you go. Yes, Tony. Yes, Kiko, good. Elbows go out, Kiko. Only if it's possible, my elbows go out. Elbows go out, elbows go out. See, my elbows are going to the side. That one, Yuji. So it's like you take a zipper and you go this way up. That's why it's called a zipper like that, Eugene, like that. Huh? <clears throat> so we do five more, four, three, two, good. One, beautiful. Okay, good, that's enough. Um, yeah, that's enough for that one. Grab one of your weighted balls. And let's bring it around. Today's Friday, so I'm gonna make it a little bit different. Okay. Let's move that energy and have some fun. Have some fun because life, especially at least for me, and once I start, I hit my 50s, time is going very fast. So I want to enjoy as much as possible and move forward as much as possible and stay strong as much as possible. Okay, five, four, five, five, three. Five, three. and now slowly you're going to reverse. You go here, you go here, you play, you play, you play. 
big life, and you play. Good, stay young. You play. Eight. Seven. Six. Five. That's one more thing. Four. Notice how this is strengthening the shoulders and you guys are playing. Four. Two, one, good. Now my left leg is forward and I bring it to the side and I bring it, toss it over my left shoulder. So I work my obliques, that one, Mary. That one, Kiko, here. That one, good. Working your midline, ready guys? And eight, seven, six, Five, four, three, two, one. Good. So this exercise is good to train your midline, right? And to um and the outside of the hips. And you're doing 10 Marilyn. Nine. Eight. Seven. Toss the ball right along the other side of the shoulder. Six, five, four, three, two, one. Good. We do one more here. Bring your feet together and let's do the atlas. From here, contract the abdomen. Is in, and I press up that one. Lift your energy, lift your spirits up. So to some extent is what I'm saying, lift your spirit here. And seven more, six, five. Lengthen, press your fingers up. Four, three, two, one, and slowly down. Good, good. Okay, get on the mat. Um, keep your band or your Pilates ring. Let's hit the mat now. Let's stretch. We're going to do balancing pose, the tiger. Here is the band and stretch. Here. Stretch the left leg and stretch up like this gene. Stretch up <clears throat> here. My chin is in. My chin is in. Pull the navel to the side. There you go. There you go. Good. Be mindful of the leg that's on the floor. So sometimes we forget when we have a tendency to always do things in one side of the body. So be mindful of both. The right leg is on the mat and the left leg is off. Good. From right there, because time is running. So from here, I'm going to do my obliques, Gene. From here and then on the hand grip, Yuji, and slowly come back off, warming you guys up. And contract the abdomen. Before you come up, you contract the abdomen. Before you come up, you contract the abdomen. Before you come up, contract the abdomen. Ten. Contract the abdomen, then come up. Nine. Eight. Seven. Six. We're doing the obliques again. The same muscle we just worked two minutes ago when we were standing up. Four. Three. Two. Good, everyone. Good. Stretch on the other side. And hold the stretch. So now take the left leg. Be mindful of the left leg that's on your mat. And then mm, activate that um, the transverse, the abdominal muscle. The other leg is on the like that. You keep, keep the left leg on the mat. Now place the hand behind the head. Contract the abdomen. So now contract the abdomen to come back up like that. Contract the abdomen like that, Jim. Contract it. 
There you go, Eugene. Good. And the, the arm that's holding the pilate string is active. So you, you can do a bicep curl if you want. If you like it that way, keep it that way, Marilyn. Otherwise, do an underhand grip. So you work the, um, the bicep, the bicep um, muscle. Eight more, you do. Seven. Ugh. Six. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Perfect. Good, good. So bring both knees inside the Pilates ring. Slowly contract the abdomen, bring the hands behind you, but not down on the floor because that's going to lift your upper back. Bring the hands on in alignment with the ears and then slowly come back up and lengthen. Good. Contract the abdomen back. And pull that abdomen in and lengthen. Again, we're stretching. We're doing some active stretching. Almost there, Kiko. And contract. Press the small, the abdomen to come up. Let's see what. Okay. And two. Okay, good. Come back, come back down. I'm going to show you guys again. Go side to side for four, for three, for two, for one. Okay, good. Let's do it this way. Watch here. I'm going to change it a little bit. So my arms are in alignment with my shoulders. And watch here. Slowly. So some of you guys are staying here. Okay. What you guys want is to go here. Notice here, not here. You want to go here, not over here, but here. Yes, much better, Val. And not here, but here. Okay, so bring the arms to shoulder height, contract the abdomen, and now press down, press down. And good. You got it, Jim. And press down. Much better. Extend the arms. Extend the arms really do not touch the uh, the mat. They are hovering over the mat about four inches. Much better. Good. Let's do one more, and then we'll fix it again. And come back down and massage the spine side to side. We're gonna do it one more time from a different angle. Massage the spine. Go from side to side for three, for two, for one. Good. So now let's do it a little bit different. From here, I extend and go here. Notice where my hands are. And now take your eyes and look forward. Extend the fingers. Pretend I'm pulling your fingers. Uh, I'm on the other side of your feet and I'm pulling the fingers. I'm pulling your fingers. That one, Jean. I'm pulling my, your fingers here. So you're being pulled by your fingers. My chin is on my sternum. I contract the abdomen. Okay, good. Now take your hands, place them underneath your, behind your knees. Good. Keep your feet down though, yeah? And now contract and come back up again. Come back up again. There you go, right there, Eugene. And hold it for four. So that's how far up you wanna go. That one, if you do it that way, you're gonna strengthen your deep transverse muscle. Now contract the abdomen, inhale, place the hands behind the head. And I contract the abdomen and come back up and come back up. And now you found your transverse abdominals. Ready, guys? You guys are doing 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4. This is your last one, guys. Four again. Three, two, and one. And slowly contract the abdomen before coming back down. And that's the muscle we want to contract before we do anything. Okay, so place your Pilates ring to the side. Take a deep breath, slowly come back up. Good, from here, doing the cut. Here, slowly do the cut and come back to neutral. Do the cut, 
come back to neutral. Press your palms down, do the cat, go back to neutral. Do three more, because I want to see what you guys are doing. Good, Marilyn. Good, Bob. Good, Jean. Good, Tony. Good. Perfect, Kiko. Good, 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 Jean. Good, everyone. Perfect. Good, good, good. Okay, slowly now go here to release the wrist. Come back here. This one is called extended child. It's going to stretch your shoulders without overdoing it, everyone, including me for four, for three, for two, for one, and slowly coming back up. So here, now let's switch muscle group and let's strengthen the hip extensors here. Go back here like that and contract the abdomen and pulse it up, pulse it up. So I want to switch my weight to my right side. I'm doing my right hip on the back. So I want to shift my weight to the right, to that side. We're doing eight, seven, six, five, four. Good, everyone. Three, two, one. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Everyone had the tail up. Perfect. Here, like that. So you guys were not, your leg was not like this. Everyone's leg was up. Good job, guys. And come back up. So I'm shifting my weight towards my left hip. There you go. And pulse it up. Pulse it up. Work it. We're going to hit as many muscles as possible today. Uh, eight more. Seven. Six. Five. Four. Good. Three. Ush, two. One. And slowly coming back up and stretch again here. Stretch for four. For three. Four, two, four, one, good. Let's do one more here, but do it different from here. Extend the right leg out, pull the abdomen in, I'm shifting my weight to my right side, and then point and come back up, Marilyn, and down. Up and down. Up and down. Eight and down. Seven, down. Six, down. Abdomen is in. Five, abdomen in. Four, inhale, exhale, three, two, good, one, good, the other side. Extend, shift your weight to the left, point the toe slowly up, keep the transfer, the muscle, the abdomen is in, abdomen is in, and now eight, Jean, seven, six, five, good, four, the leg is long, three, abdomen is in, two, and one, and slowly come back up. And from here, bring the legs out and slowly stretch forward and back. Let's do that five times. Go so here, we're stretching those same muscles we just worked. Contract the abdomen, three more, contract, uh, two, contract, one, beautiful, good. Let's see, just say muscle, Marilyn. From here, I extend the right leg, and I want to bring the right leg towards me, this way, you see that? And I bring it across, and I bring it up, and I bring it here. So I want to bring it over my right hip and across my left. and here, and bring it across. And I, there you go. And bring it down from so here, I go up and I bring it down on the other side, Kiko. Point, bring it, the leg down there, and then up and down, and bring it up, Jean, and down, yes. And Tony, yes. So up, eight, seven, small movement, Joe, six, five, Perfect, Eugene. Contract four, three, two, one. Good. So watch from here. Let, so watch here. This is what we're doing. So I go from here and I bring it across my other side and I bring it up and I go here and I bring it across and here and I bring it across like that. Okay. Let's do that. Extend, bring it across. 
and I contract. There you go. Good. Bring it across. Good. And bring it across. And there's a slice. Uh, when you hit the hip extensor, the muscle, you, you do a little bit of a lift to enhance the muscle. Eight. That one. Seven. Six. Five, four, three, whatever you want, two, and one. Good. So come back to a sitting position. Yeah. Come back to a sitting position. Uh, grab your mini ball. We we'll go back to that exercise in a minute. I want to give you guys a break. Come back here and up, here and up. Squeeze the ball here and up. That one can go here. Seven, six. So notice we're switching from the hip all the to the shoulder joint. Yeah, five, four, three, two. One, bring the hands down, contract the abdomen, gently, abdomen is thin, gently rotate the neck, release the upper trapezius for three, for two, for one, and reverse for three, for two, for one, beautiful, good. So from here, contract the abdomen, spine twist, Marilyn, contract, I contract the abdomen first, the transverse, like that, you go one, two, center, like that, keep going. Contract, Ugh. one, two, center. Limit the range of motion. The legs are long. The legs are long. Ugh. Five, abdomen is in. Mm. Four, going deep, working those deep postural muscles. Three again, Joe. Ish. Two, Ish. one, good. From here, palms are up. Bring the palms over the head this way and then press up. I will show you in a minute. I'm, just, I'm going to adjust my camera. From here, where we're here, palms are up, bend the elbows, contract the abdomen first, bend the elbows, bend the elbows, bring the fingers, fingers up, contract the abdomen, lift the chest up, lift your chest up. Push the ceiling, and now come back down. Exhale, and down. Pumps are up again, contract the abdomen jaw. Notice what happened when I contracted, I lift it. And now bend the elbows here, bend the elbows. It's similar to the Atlas UG, but the hands are not behind you. The hands are on the crown of the head. Now contract the abdomen, lift through your glutes, right? And press up, 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 up. Let's do five, bring it back down and press up, 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 up. This one is called uh, um, holding up the sky in Qigong and in Pilates, I think, oh, the name is escaping me right now. Press up, three, up, push the ceiling up, two, and one, and press down. Oh. Beautiful, good. Now we go to balancing pose. The name will come to me. Okay. Fall uh, to the side. Rotate the wrist for three, for two, for one. Reverse for three, two, one. Good. So here, balancing pose. Oh, it's called the Lotus. L O T U S. That this this one coming up is called the Lotus. L O T T U S. Okay, so from here, contract the abdomen. I'm extending the right arm. I shift my weight to the right leg and I'm balancing. I extend through my left arm and I pull the abdomen in. So here you want the abdomen contracted. You want the abdomen contracted. Pull the uh, transverse abdominals. Pull that muscle in. Perfect. Good. Now extend the opposite arm, Kiko. Good. Now extend the other arm. That one and hold it right there. That, that's it, but much better, much better. Keep that leg up. Four, eight, yes, Jim, yes, yes, yes. Three, two, and release. 
Yeah, <laughs> good job, Gene. Perfect. So here I'm extending. First thing I do that I like to do because the leg weighs heavier than my arm, I contract the abdomen. I am extending my left leg to hip height. I lengthen the back of the neck and I'm extending through my right arm. And I want to pull the abdomen in and I want to lengthen. So basically what we're trying to do here, what you guys are trying to do is to balance the left side and the right side of the body. Perfect gene. Yes, Tony, extend the arm now, Kiko. Extend the arm, extend the opposite arm. That one for four. Like that, Marilyn, three. Much better, but I'm going. Two, and slowly down and come back and release your wrist. For three, two, and reverse for three, two, one. Good, I need a little bit of coconut water. Uh, so where am I? Okay. Right side. So I'm extending the right arm. And I bring my left hand. I'm going to show you facing you here. So this is my right leg, my right, my left. Inhale. And I go here, here. And I go there, here. And I go there, okay? So I contract and I go one here, two here. So I'm moving the spine, three, four, five, four, three, two, and one, good, the other side. I know that's challenging, Marilyn, yeah? Good, so watch again. So I'm gonna do my other side now here, like that. I'm extending my right, I go, I bring it in, and I go to the, to the front if possible, you do. It's okay to bring it to the side, okay? But also it's okay to bring it up to the front. Here, what I'm trying to do here is to move the energy. Normally, we hold the pose after this. You guys are not going to do that today. You go here, you're moving the energy. You go inhale, you exhale. I want your full skeleton to open in and out like an accordion, like an accordion. There you got it, Gene. Inhale, exhale, moving the spine, moving the spine. You got to keep going, moving the spine, four. Moving the spine, work it, Marilyn. Three, two, that one, Eugene, that one, that one, perfect, good, good, good. And now <laughs> release. I know that is challenging, but this is the type of work that we rarely gonna do, mm, we rarely do. And normally, no, notice that we do a lot of the work supine on our backs, but it's okay to change. I think one of you guys were talking about it um, before, I think it was Gene. We need to learn how to be on the floor, right? We wanna learn, we, the longer we stay here, we practice, the better for us, I think, long-term. It's not like when sometimes people go on the floor, it's like they've never been on the floor for the last, since they were children. But you guys are children Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. <laughs> so you wanna do that, okay? So I'm gonna do it again. So the idea behind here is to bring life into the into inside the body. It's like contracting, expanding, contracting, expanding. We're gonna do only five on each side and then we move on because time is running out. So notice, I do inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Ready guys? You guys are doing five, contract, four, contract, three, Contract, two, contract, one. Good, do the other side and then we do the physio ball. You got it, Marilyn. Work it, Marilyn, you can do this. There you go, that's it, that's what I'm trying to do, yeah? There you go, that's it, Marilyn, five, four. Work it, three, ah, Kiko, that's what I'm talking about. Yes, yes, Gene, yes, yes, Bob. Yes, Tony, two, you got it, guys. And one, okay, okay. See, that's cool, different. 
that's very different from from the a lot of the training that um, people want us to do we want to do that, that kind of training but also do a little something we want to be unique you want to be unique okay here we go let's grab your piece of ball how about if you guys grab the loop let's play again Let's play again. Grab your loop. Five minutes here, and then class will be over. Okay. okay, Mr. Joe, let's rock and roll. Take the band and let's play. Speed back. You guys want to strengthen your shoulders. Good. Ready? 10, 9, 8, 7. Play. 6 is like a kitten, like a cat. Playing. 5, 4, 3, 2. And now you guys are going to reverse it. Reverse it, contract the, uh, the abdomen, sit tall, the legs are wide apart for balance. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, good, 5. Flex the muscles, 4, 3, 2, good, come back down, hands inside, palms to the side, then come back here. Contract, my palms are facing down. My palms are facing down. Good. So here I contract the abdomen. My spine is long. I activate the band. So here, contract the abdomen, activate the band. Be careful on this one, Marilyn. Up to the shoulders, up to the shoulders, like that. Up to the shoulders, up to the shoulders. So you work in the levator scapula. When you guys get here, bring it down to midline, mid, mid to the belly button, and then slowly up, Yuji down and then up to the shoulders you up to your shoulders so you're going a little bit higher than your shoulders just to the shoulders there you go just to the shoulders because i'm going to strengthen the muscles in the scapula that one can go good up to the shoulders everyone there you go shoulder or maybe half an inch below the shoulder Woohoo! four three yeah two one, good, go back to speed back. Go back to speed back. Move that energy. We're doing eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and now reverse it. This is your last set with the band, guys. Eight, seven, six. Extend, flex those muscles. Activate the upper back, activate the the biceps, you hold it, the deltoids. Three, two, one. Perfect, good, okay. Grab your weighted balls. Oh, oh challenging. <laughs> okay, good, the Atlas UG. Here, I'm leaning slightly forward, okay? Contract the abdomen, press up. Go here. So lifting the shoulders up, lifting the anterior, the front of the body, and the back muscles up. Eight, seven. Contract the abdomen before coming up. Six, like that, Tony. Five, four, three. Feel your the back shoulder, the deltoid getting stronger. Three, two, good. One, bring the weights down, contract the abdomen, rotate the neck, pull the abdomen in. For three, for two, for one, gently reverse. For three, for two, for one. Good, from right there, contract the abdomen, biceps, and down, biceps, and down biceps and down biceps and down biceps 
and down, biceps and down, biceps and down, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, contract the abdomen before lifting the weights or the dumbbells, 4 again, Joe, 3, tricep after this, so doing biceps, after this triceps, 2, UG, 1, so from here, go back, and back, go here, and back, go here, and back, go here, 10, Marilyn, 9, good, 8, like that, keep going, let's see, Bob. yes, yes, Gene, yes, Tony, yes, UG, Marilyn, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, good. So from here, bring the shoulders back this way, towards the back, towards the back, toward, nice, team, towards the back, that one, towards the back, towards the back, five, towards the back, four, strengthening your pecs, strengthening your upper back, strengthening your postural muscles, your spine, for three, for two, reverse. We release the cervical after this, for six, five, four, three, two, one. Good, now slowly do small circles, do very small circles for the nose, for three, for two, for one, reverse for three, for two, for one, good. So now combine those two movements, Yuji. You go one and two, one and two, like that, Val. one and two, nice, Tony. So you go, yes, yes. Good, Gina Marilyn, yes, 10. Nine, eight, eight. Keep the weights as close as possible to your midline. So notice that I'm keeping the weight as close as possible, as close as possible to your body. Where am I? Six, contract here, Joe. Five, four. Keep the weight as close as possible to your body. Keep the elbows as close as possible to you. Three, two, we're doing the zipper after this. And one, the zipper is this one. From here, contract the abdomen. You go here, not here. See that? It's like that, Marilyn. It's right here, contract. So the muscles are active, like that you give. And here, contract. So going back to your upper pecs, going back to your shoulders again. Eight again, Kiko. Ish. Seven, good, Tony. Elbows out. Keep it again. Keep your... The dumbbells or, or your weighted balls as close as possible to your uh, the front of the body. Six, five, four, three, two. We're going to do um, the abs and the pecs after this. Two again. One from here. You go down. So from here, Kiko, you walk your feet forward. Walk your feet forward. You go here. Now let me move towards the center. Here. So you want the hips here, right here, like that, Bob. And go here, and then slowly this way. Like that, Yuji. Like that, Jin. Here. Like that. Walk your feet forward. Keep going. Walk your feet forward. Walk your feet forward towards the front, towards the other side, away from the ball. Away from the ball. Walk your feet forward. Yeah. Keep going until you're almost laying down. Keep going, 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 keep going. Good. Now from there, from there, do a sit up and bring the weights together. Bring the elbows together. You got it, Val. Much better, Val. From there, Val. There you go. Almost, you're almost guys on the floor. Nice, Yuji. Eight, seven, Yuji. Six, five. You feel the, the ball massaging your low back, actually. Ah, five again, Yuji. Marilyn, you got it. 
elbows together if you can. Bring the elbows together as much as possible to strengthen your pecs. Uh, six. Elbows together, Kiko. Bring the elbows together. Bring the elbows together. Look across the room. Look across the room towards your knees. There you go. Four. Much better. Three. Uh, two. One. Good. Drop the weighted balls right there. Place the hands behind the head. Contract the abdomen and come back and do us. Work the front of the abdomen, the rectus abdominals here, like that. So this exercise here is to elongate the spine in the back. Elongate the spine. And looking down, look towards, look towards the floor, Kiko. Look towards the floor. Ready? Pull the abdomen in. Seven. Ah, six. Five. This is your last one. Four. Ish. Three. Ish. Two. Ish. One and slowly contract and slowly get off the ball without with control like that. Perfect. Good. We are done, guys. Beautiful. Good. Here we go. Gate pose. Toes are back. Inhale here. Pull the abdomen in and go to the side. Um, Keep the abdomen in. Marine, that's better. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Good. Keep that abdomen in, okay? To protect the spine. Yes, Jean. Yeah, fine. Good. Good, we go. Good, three, two. Contract the abdomen. Contract the transverse. Come back. Beautiful. The other side, Marine. Contract, bring it to the side. So contract the abdomen first. The shoulders are forward if possible. Contract the abdomen and slowly go. Without overdoing it. Yes, you contract. That, that one, Kiko. That one. There you go. Much better, Rob. Yes, Jim. Keep the abdomen contracted. Hold it at least 20 seconds. Contract the abdomen. Contract the abdomen, slowly coming back up. Beautiful. Now hit the floor, guys. Same exercises on the floor. Right here. So now extend here. So now you're gonna stretch the back and also do a side bend. I contract the abdomen here, Marilyn, and I go slowly. You can stay here, and then if, you, if you're able, only if you're able, you slowly go back half an inch, quarter of an inch. Remember, we're working at the nerve center with nerves, and you barely, can, you actually you cannot see them. So small movements are better than global movements. Keep the abdomen in. This exercise is to help you guys improve your flexibility. This exercise right here. Keep the navel to the spine. Abdomen is in, contracted. Now contract the abdomen, inhale. Come back. So the heel is in alignment with my, the tailbone or with my, my knee line. I contract the abdomen again. My body is forward. I contract the abdomen, Marilyn, good, and slowly. Keep the abdomen in. Keep it contracted. Keep it contracted. Keep it contracted. Much better. Keep it contracted. Two more breaths like that, Rob. Keep the abdomen in. Now contract the abdomen, slowly coming back to center. Good. From there, just bring both feet forward. So now this is another way of improving your flexibility. This one is called round back. Go here and then slowly release. We have less than a minute, guys. Come back. Pull. Here you want to, like that, Kiko. You want to round your back. So we're doing the cat, except we're sitting down. 
and then come back to center, Yuji. There you go. And feet up nice, G. And shoulders are back. And last one, inhale here. And beautiful. Good boy. So contract your abdomen. Place the right hand on your knee. And gently place the hand on your, not too much on your ear, but above the ear. And gently, gently, just gently, my, the, the spine is long, just gently, gently press the hand, press the head in the hand, but not too much pressure. And slowly release, place the left hand on the left knee, contract the abdomen. So apply very light pressure. The spine is long, very light pressure. Good release. So now with the left hand right in front of the head, make sure the spine is long. So very light pressure on top. The, the hand is on your forehead. Very light pressure. Good release. The right hand contract behind the head. And the spine is long. Very light pressure towards the back. And release. Now from there, the spine is long. Small circles with your nose. Three, and see if you can find a smile. And two, and then the reverse. Inhale slowly, exhale. The abdomen is in, and your energy is up. The spine is long for two, for one, and you stop in the center. And we'll stop there for today. Abdomen is in, inhale up, press out. Contract the abdomen, bring the hands on top of you on your, what we call executive control in, in coaching. In executive coaching, this is called the executive control, your executive coach. He or she is on the top, the crown of the head. You want to bring that part of you into your center, close to your heart. Your spine is long and you want to keep her there. 